premium members on my website are receiving a 10 minute exclusive arm back legs abs and weight loss workout this week this video was made available to my premium members on sunday if you're not a member on my site go start your free trial so you can get access to that workout it's not going to be posted on youtube if you are already a member make sure you log in give it a shot that workout is so good this video is going to answer so many questions for you you need to know some of these things so let's go straight into the first thing make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already it's totally free for you and it just means so much to me this was the photo that started me on my booty growth journey so i think we can all agree that i have come a very long way from where i started and i'm okay with where i am right now i'm not trying to change anything i'm very okay but there are certain things that i learned the hard way and i see a lot of you on my booty program learning this the hard way as well so i thought i would just make this video and save you some stress have you subscribed yet please subscribe if you haven't done so already i really appreciate that number one growing your booty is a two-step process step one is doing the booty program to get your booty to the juicy level that you want it to be at then step two is now losing the extra fat that you will inevitably gain in the process of growing your booty i didn't know this i didn't know this i was just like my booty is looking nice and then i reached my goal and i was like oh wait there's also some extra fat now i have to lose that so that's something you need to know going in just keep that in your mind it's a two-step process and that second part where you're trying to lose the excess fat that you're probably going to gain in the process of growing your booty did you know you're not going to go back to where you started but your booty when you lose the extra fat in your step two is going to be slightly smaller than your booty was when you finished the booty program so you're going to be somewhere in the middle and it's a very sad day when you realize that oh my gosh like it's bigger it's juicier it's better but it's not the same as it was when you were eating two, 300 calories extra every day trying to grow your butt. Number two, this is even worse. There's no way to say this in a gentle way, so I'm just gonna say this very aggressively. If you work out to grow your booty, guess what? You have to work out to maintain your booty. In the personal training world, we have a fancy word for this. We call this reversibility. If you stop working out when you reach your goal, guess what's gonna happen? You're gonna go straight back to where you started from. And this applies to all types of exercise, not just booty exercises. You have to maintain your results and you maintain your results by continuing to do booty exercises. It's basically a lifetime sentence of doing glute bridges. You're not gonna do as much work to maintain your booty as you have to do to get your booty to the size you want, but you do have to do something. I've seen some comments where people are like, I did the workouts, I got to my goal, and now three months later, I'm back to where I started. Well, it's because you stopped working out. You can't stop working out. You need to keep working out forever. Number three lifting heavy is extremely important if you are a professional bodybuilder a bikini competitor an athlete or it is your job to lift heavy things for the rest of us normal people it's not about lifting heavy especially in the beginning in the beginning it is about your work volume when you hear people say lift heavy lift heavy they're not talking to you they're not talking to me. They're talking to their fellow bodybuilders, their fellow bikini competitors, their fellow weightlifters, their fellow athletes. They're not talking to those of us that still low-key like McDonald's. They're not. For us, especially if you're a beginner, what you need to focus on is your work volume. Your work volume is how much time or how many reps of an exercise you can do at a weight that is challenging for you. The weight that's challenging for you may or may not be heavy. For some people, 15 pounds is challenging. 20 pounds is challenging. I think you may be surprised to hear that when I use ankle weights for my exercises, I never go higher than two and a half pounds per ankle. You're not gonna catch me with 10 pounds on my ankles saying I'm doing some, no, I'm not. Lifting heavy is just one way to have high work volume. It's not the only way. Number five, you can be low carb and keto and grow your booty. So if you're doing a low carb diet or you're doing a keto type of thing and it is working for you, you're enjoying it, you like it, you don't have to come off of that just to do booty building. It's not necessary. You can continue to do your keto thing. Just make sure your protein is on point, make sure your macros are on point and your body will respond. Keep in mind, Carbs and fat are not the devil. They're not anything special. They are just energy sources for your body. If you're doing low carb or keto and it's working for you, it just means your body does well getting energy from fat. So if your body already does well getting energy from fat, just get your macros correct, stay on your keto low carb lifestyle and get your results. You don't have to switch diets just to grow your booty. 
This is a bonus one that I wasn't going to say before because it's a little bit trivial, but it is a thing that happens. When you grow your booty to a certain point, it's going to be impossible to find jeans that actually fit. They will never fit at your waist because your proportions are not what the manufacturers expect. The only way would be to either buy really expensive jeans or buy jeans you can afford and then have to be adjusting the waist, neither of which is really something that I like, but I feel like it's a, it's a, it's a good problem to have, but just keep that in mind. You're gonna have to have a savings account for jeans. Thank you for watching this video. Check out my booty program, it's eight weeks. It's pretty awesome. I see a lot of you signing up for it. I'm loving seeing you loving the booty workout because it's so good. Check it out on my website, kobokofitness.com and I will see you in my next video.